The other day, a father of a first grader got some troubling news because his wife assigned him to work with another parent on the school fundraiser. That's the troubling news. Well, in his mind, it's the worst thing possible. Really? He'd rather do pretty much anything else than yeah. have to work with a complete stranger on a school project. Oh, boy. But he's about to meet that person today, and it's none other than our own Brooke Fox. Yay! Who's already dreamed up some exciting money-making mm-hmm. ideas in Involving their kids. Mm-hmm. And you're going to hear them in your phone tap right now. Hello? Hi, is this Kurt, Kendall's father? Uh, yeah, it is. Uh, who's this? Oh, great, Kurt. This is Diane Hader. Our kids are in the same class. I think the PTA paired us up for the upcoming auction. Oh, right, right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we're supposed to come up with some ideas. I'm sure you know my son. I mean, who doesn't? Player. Um... What's his name? Player. I'm sorry. Are you saying player or are you saying player like a player on a on a field? I am <laughs> No, it's player. Like he's a player. No. Player hater. That's his Our name. last name's Hater. H A D E R, of course. Oh, is it it's a nickname. Oh. <laughs> no, no, no. No. You're starting to get insulting, Kurt. No, it's not a nickname. Uh, I apologize. We just wanted to go with something unique, unlike Kendall. But anyway, oh. I was just wondering if we could go over some ideas that I have for the school fundraiser. Sure. Because I have been brainstorming. I didn't know we were supposed to come up with ideas already, but... Um... <laughs> Welcome to the hater family, because we are on top of it. So my first thought is to do a calendar. Have you ever seen those fundraising calendars? I have. Those, I think they're adorable. They always sell. It's a fun idea. Agreed. And I just want you to picture this. Your daughter, Kendall, is with my son, Player, in different hot tubs all over the city. (laughs) You're you're saying our children will be in hot tubs? He'll have gold chains, and then she can wear a two-piece with a theme of the month, like October jack-o'-lanterns all over that little tiny bikini. (laughs) Isn't that adorable? Um, I don't think that's appropriate. What part? The chains, the children in first grade in hot tubs. Oh, um, don't worry. The chains will be 24 karat. We wouldn't want to misrepresent the hater family. Yeah, I guess you, you wouldn't. How, um, I, just thinking here, noodling, do you think, do you have other ideas? Maybe we... <laughs> of course, noodle away, because my next one, total smash hit... A kissing booth with Playa. Oh, my God. He is very experienced for his age. And listen, I know a lot of people are freaking out about germs these days. So I was just thinking that the kissing booth would be just your daughter over and over again. I just, I have to ask you, are you joking about this? No, and the cutest part is we could take Polaroid pictures and then sell those for extra. I, I, that is you know, like one of those not, old timey things that people put up. No, actually, I I, I, I don't. I I, I oh. this is very. You know what? If Kendall is a late bloomer, I get it. What? Okay, she's seven, so she shouldn't be blooming at that mm. age. No one, no child. I, this is starting to feel surreal to me. I, I, You're probably feels, one of those families that limits screen time, too. That's so cute. <laughs> no, actually, as a matter of That's fact, so it's somewhat disturbing to me. Listen, it, no judgment uh, from me. I get it. Maybe you're more into the arts, and that's why I think you're going to love my next idea. The road we're going down, I highly doubt it. But so I heard Kendall does ballet. Yes. Wouldn't it be great if Playa and Kendall, they just go to a local gentleman's club and convince some of the ladies to donate some of their tips to the school? Are are you are you drunk right now? Did you this is Playa already knows these ladies. What? They're his babysitters. His babysitters? Who else would be available during the day when I have to go to work? I think a call needs to be made to the principal because there's no way I and Kendall and my family are going to work with the Hater family who has a kid named Playa Hater. I don't even know where to begin with that. I'm not even processing all of the insanity. <laughs> I'm sorry, but when you say Playa Hater at the same time when you're mad, it's so funny. <laughs> it, 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 there's nothing that's funny about this at all. Do you really play for yourself what it's you actually, actually said? Kurt, it's funny because it's a prank phone call. 
There's, I don't find anything funny that you No, think it's a that... phone tap. My name is Brooke from the radio show Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning, and your wife Jane set you up. <laughs> what are you saying? Say that again. I'm saying this is all a joke. Jane said you were complaining about having to do uh, something for the school God. fundraiser with a family you didn't know. Oh, so... my God. I was... <laughs> My son, Playa Hata, okay? <laughs> Don't be jealous, Kurt. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm having a delayed reaction. I can't. <laughs> Just make sure you bring your $1 bills and you'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs>